G'day Purple fam, that guy Perps here, back with another music reaction video. We're jumping back into Home Free. It has been a minute, and I did say on the last one, do you guys want to see me do more? It was an overwhelming yes. So, we're going to get back into them. Um, this is their new one, Crazy. I have no idea what it's about. I don't know if it's um, you know, a cover of another song, if it's an original or, or what. We're just going to check it out um yeah check out <laughs> check out these wonderful voices um and like i was saying before and we sort of know what to expect with these guys they're gonna have the harmonies they're gonna have that deep rich bass line with its own little melody going on adam on the beatboxing is going to be doing his thing um but i guess like you were saying you know each one is unique each one is different and that's why we love watching them you know like since I found these guys, um, I, I do enjoy reacting to them. I do enjoy listening to them. Um, acapella groups aren't really something that I, you know, seek out and, and find. And I probably would never have heard these guys if it wasn't for you guys. So, um, yeah, thank you very much uh, again. And let's check out Crazy, see where we're at. Meanwhile, my uh, my doggo over here is going a bit crazy. Uh, bear with me one second. I've just got to get this blanket sorted for her. She was doing that whole, uh, you know, thing where they, they clean themselves and they, they lick and it's like real, <laughs> and I was like, oh, cop, what are you doing? So I had to wait for her for like five minutes before I could record because I didn't want that sound on, on the channel and then here I am making it myself. So, um, <laughs> yeah, so we're back. Uh, I'm still crazy as ever. Uh, still got no memory. So we're going to see if I can remember these guys. I know there's, there's two Adams, um, there's an Austin, there's a Tim, and there's normally a Rob. Um, Rob's pretty easy to remember. He, he's very distinctive looking. I always get Tim and Austin mixed up, and I don't know why. They, they don't look anything alike, I don't think. But, yeah, I don't know. There's something in the head that goes, oh, that's Tim. Well, that's Austin. Oh, that's Austin. No, that's Tim. So, yeah, without any further ado, if you do like the original guys, make sure you go to the link in the description and check it out in full. I will be pausing. That's what I do. If you don't like that, Hit the link, go and go and check them out in full now. But um, yeah, let's get into it. Righto, so we had Adam, Adam. Now, I want to say Tim, so it's probably Austin. <laughs> and then Rob. And then if that's Austin, the other guy's Tim. Crazy. I'm crazy for a feeling. Mm. So because I talked over that, that magnificent intro, we're going to go back and uh, listen to that again. Now, this is a cover, I do believe. I think I've heard this song, um, I don't know if it's, you know, like the 50s, 60s era, or if it's earlier than that, that's been redone and redone. But it is one of these these classic songs. Um, so, yeah, we'll, we'll, see, we'll see where we end up at the end. Well, midway through, but... <laughs> Like, I know there's other acapella groups out there, um, you know, just done a Pentatonix reaction, probably do another one soon, um, maybe today, maybe tomorrow, not sure. Um, but yeah, like, I've heard, also heard an Aussie one, um, something north, you guys will know exactly who I'm talking about. Um, I did one song and they did a Tim Minchin cover. Um, again, memory, gone. Um, but yeah, what I was saying is, is in terms of harmony, you know, like in terms of just that overall 
vibe that you get from them. I haven't heard anyone that that sounds like this. You know, like there's others that have you know really good harmony, and then they come in and they add some theatrics and they they do whatever just to liven the show up a little bit. Um, but they this group can can literally just you know they could sit in a corner of a room and just be sitting there, you know, clicking their finger and just singing, and you'd be amazed. Like they're it's sort of soothing, it's calming. But it's also exciting at the same time. I don't know what it is about them. But um, yeah, I think so far they're doing an amazing job with this song. Um, like I'm not over the original 100%. I do do recognize, you know, the some of the words that they're putting together. Um, but I don't know if how much they've switched it up. I don't know if they're adding extra verses. You know, I don't know. You know yeah, that sort of thing. Um, but what I am hearing is... Yeah, it's definitely up there with all their other songs that I've heard. I um, wonder if uh, anyone else is going to take the lead or if it's just going to be Austin. See, I've still I second guess myself now. And then I'm going, no, it's Tim, no, it's Austin. But um, yeah, so we'll, we'll see how it goes. I'd you know, be happy either way. He does an amazing job when he takes the lead. Um, I feel that where he's register is with his voice when he's singing uh, obviously he can fluctuate that they're all pretty good at singing but he seems to sing like this a lot of the time so to me i'm going to assume that this is more of his natural sort of range where he likes singing in it works really well with the harmony of the rest of the guys singing there so um i'm sure you guys all understand what i'm talking about um and you know feel free to call me an idiot in the comments it's been done plenty of times before but um you know, it is a reaction and this is how I'm reacting to it. You know, it is, it's sort of soothing and, and sort of good. And at the same time, it's sort of always interesting to see what they bring to the table, how they're going to flip it up, how they're going to change it. Um, and yeah, let's get back into it. Also, like there, when they when they cut to this scene, like obviously there's the scene where they were not wearing jackets, and then here when they're in the jackets, it looks I don't know if it's like a subway platform or, or something, or if it's a dance hall, but you know the one with the people going in the background here, um, just the period dress, you know, like it that's not something you see people wear nowadays, you know that style of suit, her style of top with dress, you know, like it's I don't know I don't know what era it is, um, but it just I don't know there's something about the way they put together their videos as well. Like this really suits the vibe that I'm getting. Um, that and obviously being in black and white, it sort of takes you there as well. So everything's sort of drawing you into this sort of, you know, old feel. And then um, I guess, you know, with the, you know, an older song and then they're bringing it to life now, like when they're standing there just with the crazy uh, words all written up on the screen. Um, it just, you know, it, it's those little touches they do that, that make, sort of good groups great or like um mediocre groups sort of step up to that next level and be on that upper echelon you know there's probably probably many people in the world that that can sing as good as one or two of these people um uh, but you know unless you've got the whole performance you'll never make it up that level so um yeah i, I just like in this one how you know obviously here you, know, you can see they're not wearing a jacket and with the crazy sign above them like i was saying and they've all got like the pinstripe tie sort of thing. And then it moves across 
Um, to there where they all got their jackets on. That's what I was trying to get across before. But, um, yeah, like, let me know what you think of it so far, guys. Um, is this, you know, up in uh, the top performances that you've, or top releases that they've done for you? Or uh, do you still like some of their older stuff a bit better? Um, yeah, let me know down in the comments. And then, yeah, the the old film, you know, the 8mm or 35mm, whatever it was back in the day, depending on the platform you used, just that flickering over. Um, everything just sort of ties in and, and just makes it makes it great. Um, I think it's crazy how effortlessly they all are when they're singing. You know, none of them seem to be putting any effort in at all. It's just, this is just them chilling. You know, this is just, yeah, and it's so beautiful and soothing. Um but yeah, let me know in the comment section, guys, or hit me up on Instagram, whatever. Let me know what other home free I should do. Have been a couple of really great people on Instagram, um, making sure that I'm up to date with uh, what's coming out next, things I should be checking out. Um, yeah, just little helpful hints and tips, which muchly appreciate. And um, yeah, like always, if you did like the reaction, guys, make sure to hit the thumbs up. Um, if you didn't hit the thumbs down, you know, it's, uh, it's all good. Um, if you are new to the channel and you did like what I did here, maybe consider subscribing. We do all different sorts of music over here. Um, so there's, there's rap country, uh, there's rock, there's, there's yeah, a bit of everything for everyone. Um, the whole point is to, you know, for me to have you guys suggest new music to me that I'm never hidden or never listened to because I've hidden it away and then, or not you know, bothered to even check it out, um, but we've had some emo rock, um, wasn't a genre that I'd even touched before, um, home free, acapella, not really something that I'd touched before, but now, you know, getting a better appreciation for these sorts of musicians, what they bring to the table, um, and everyone has a place, you know, like, every part of music has a place on the musical plate, you know, and it's, it's just whether you want to eat a bit of this, or eat a bit of that, or you know, whatever you get your feel. Some people just like dessert and want to go straight for hip hop. Some people, you know, want to rock out and, and whatever all the time. Um, I'm trying to sort of broaden the horizons a little bit and, and you know, tap into a few different things that I, you know, like I said, wouldn't have otherwise checked out. So, yeah, consider subscribing. Hit that notification bell to make sure you know when I'm dropping new stuff. Um, it should be more regular now. We did have a bit of a break. I had to upgrade some things <laughs> to make it a little bit a little bit better for you guys uh but yeah like always guys i'm that guy perps and until next time i'll see you then <laughs>